if you're a single-handed or short-handed sailor, you'll know that when you're anchoring a boat, you've got to be in two places at once. The front of the boat where the anchor controller is wired in and the back of the boat where you can run it. To deal with that problem when there's only one of you, you get a radio-controlled anchor windlass. Had this one for years, works brilliantly. This is Coastline Technologies. Uh, run this on two boats now, works great. Always had two control units because you can break one or drop one in the water. One of them broke, so I called the guys and said, can I have another one? They said, we don't make it anymore. What they did say was, and this was Clive Lachlan, thanks Clive at Coastline Technologies, said, we've got this other one, can you test it for us? It's even better. This one here, fantastic unit, does everything the last one did, but this one's got an anchor chain counter, which I used to have to do by counting in my head and guessing. Now I know exactly what's going on. When I turn this thing on, it tells me how much chain is out at any moment in time, 25 meters at the moment. This allows me to be at the front and the, uh, at the back of the boat or wherever I want to be on the boat and know exactly how much chain I've got and have full control of the chain. Let me show you how it works. Right, I've got about five meters of water, really easy day. Let's go. No speed at all, perfect. And we've 25 meters of chain out. So I've been using this unit for a while now. It's been absolutely flawless. I can't recommend it enough. Only thing I would say, as I did with the previous units, is it's better to have two control units, not one. If you do happen to lose one of them overboard or break one of them, then you can always go to another one without having to recable something. But yeah, thanks very much guys, fantastic bit of kit, well done.